candy corn. Mm, delicious. Only Brock's though. It's got to be Brock's. Hey everybody, Yogi here. Doing well. I hope you're doing well. It's day four. And it's pretty late in the day. I didn't really do a whole lot today. I did a lot of um, editing. Not No, not even editing. I took all my files on my phone and on the GoPro that I shot the last three days. And um, named the files so I have them ready to edit. You won't be seeing these probably for another month. And I got up and I... Um, Got ready and I went and worked out and I kind of overdid it working out because I'm feeling it today. I'm feeling pretty sore. And then I went and um, went to Walmart in Crossville, Dollar Tree in Crossville, and then Bucky's. Bucky's was disappointing. I had a brisket sandwich for lunch and a sausage on a stick. And the brisket sandwich was mostly fat. So that was very, it was the, the XXL, the, 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 I grabbed that by mistake. I, I grabbed the extra, extra large when it was like $13 for the sandwich. I get it home and I'm like, oh, I grabbed the wrong sandwich. Um, then I had the sausage on a stick and both of them were, eh. Actually early in the morning, I took my niece and nephew, Carter and Jordan, went to the park, played some pickleball. Never played pickleball before, it was kind of fun. Then uh, came back, did those, ran those errands, Carter came with me for that. Came back, hung out, had lunch, then Carter wanted to play some basketball, so we went to the playground and played some basketball. We played some uh, horse, him and I, a couple games of that, so I've, I'm pretty sore. I mean, I'm not used to doing all this working out. My kids are older now, so um, I'm pretty sore, considering it's, uh, I'm as old as I am. <laughs> I feel so old. <laughs> I do. It's like I'm really, really trying to... To have fun with them and stuff and it just today it just seemed like i did too much and it's dinner time right now but we're going swimming and then um i don't know we might poke around do some driving i'm gonna bring the old gopro here all right so the outdoor pool that we were going to go to says they were open till i think 6 30 and it's like 5 30 now and they were closed <laughs> so we decided to come here saint george marina they're open till seven. It's got a nice little uh, beachy area to lay down. There's nobody else in the water. <laughs> There's nobody here. <laughs> it's like they must have been here all day and now everybody's gone and here we are. I smell food on this thing, I do. Oh, that would be, mm, throw some ribs on there. Brisket, oh yeah. I'm not going in, I brought my trunks. Uh, I was gonna go in the outdoor pool, but I'm not going in the lake. I just don't feel like it. So there's Jordan and uh, Carter. And uh, yeah. They're both dancing. It's a nice little, nice little area here. This is nice. Look at that beautiful view. It would be nice to come here and just lounge out here all day long. Stuck on it. Get ready. Three, two, one. <laughs> <laughs> Fishies. Could you do it again? Look at they're feeding the fish. Here's Carter about feeding the fish. Voila. Don't dump them in like that. Here. Look at those beautiful fish. Now I throw a line right here. I'm trying to see what kind those are. I'm gonna, try to get, I'm gonna try to get them to come by me. I can't really tell what kind of fish are those. Oh yeah, there's some little ones here closer. Oh, there's a big one right there. Hey folks, Yogi here, doing well. Hope you're doing well. Um, it is Tuesday, I think. Wait, what is today? Yeah, Tuesday. <laughs> August 20th, 2024, as I film this. Um, day five, left last Friday. So Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday is day five of my tan sleigh trip. 
Um, today, I, I well, I have to go to Walmart to get a couple things, but uh, other than that, I think I'm going to just drive around the Crossville, Tennessee area and try to come across some abandoned stuff, um, anything of interest. So, yeah. So we got this really nice Nissan Pathfinder that we rented, and it's, re it's really nice. It's a nice vehicle. The uh, shifting... Um, controls are a little wonky but other than that it's it's nice real nice so we're gonna head over to walmart and yeah we will uh go look for some stuff today hey yogi here um we are outside of i guess you could call this crossville tennessee there is a, some abandoned here that we're going to take a look at today. Uh, we got this. This creepy old abandoned church. There's no sign. There's no nothing. It says the lighthouse. There's an old faded sign there. It says the lighthouse. There is no uh, no trespassing signs. Doesn't say we can't be here, so well, it's kind of creepy. They got windows, eh? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna follow you back. You got a couple windows. Gotta be careful here for grass snakes. I don't know if you can see in them. Oh, you can't. Oh, they're all frosted. Oh well. Kind of freaky though. Yeah, this probably hasn't been in the use for quite a while. It's like no information. So I don't know if it, after it was a church, it was called the lighthouse for some reason. I don't know. All this side's just nothing but growth. And then next door to it, we've got another abandoned building. This was an old driveway leading back to a fence. Oh, there's an old outpost or an old out outbuilding right there. Can't really tell what that says. Again, I don't see any signs seeing no trespassing, so gonna check this one out too don't know what this was at one time but that's what it looks like now nothing that's some weird doors right there yeah, I don't know I don't know if we can look in maybe we can You don't know so easy now. Huh? Well, whatever it is inside, it's empty. You can see inside there. Chair, maybe. A whole lot of nothing going on there. Found two abandoned places so far on the main drag going into uh, Fairfield Glade. This one here. And the church right over there.